Yan, good morning, everyone. Uh, PSEI uh, is still resisting. It's still around 8,000. Ang tagal mag-breakout. Um, Bitcoin reached a very high level. 13K uh, just earlier. So, ang tindi. Tindi ni Bitcoin. Ang hirap pasuki ni Bitcoin ngayon. No, I'm really waiting for Bitcoin to really make a pullback again. But somehow, it's not giving us... Uh, it's not giving us that position. Um, might as well, siguro, I don't want to go FOMO, pero breakout strategies might go down. Yun yung kinatatakutan ko. It's against my trading strategy already na medyo mataas na at uh, FOMO levels na siya ngayon. Kaya hindi ko, hindi ko mahuli-huli si Bitcoin. Eh. But then again, so good news for those who are invested in Bitcoin. 13,000 yesterday. Um, I am into XRP yung parang kapatid nila na medyo nasa hulihan at least doon mas, mas nahuhuli natin but then again um, 13k na that's very big congratulations to those who has Bitcoin guys sell nyo na po um, portion yan take profits on some of it if ever malaki na yung gains niyo. don't fall in love never fall in love with your with your uh, with your positions okay um, we'll talk more about that ang ganda ng mga positions pa rin uh, sa PSE uh, most of our picks are going up and I have few, few picks today um, I have a favorite today which we'll be discussing in a while and, um, yung picks ko po andyan sa video description pwede nyo po makita should you wanna see it in advance I'm gonna go to the comment section one moment please I'm gonna go to this comment session section and Read the request. If you have any requests, um, please post it on the on the chat room para mabasa po natin ang uh, charts nila. Um, please share the video, share po ang video sa Facebook walls niyo so that your friends will be curious about stock market, about investing. Also to your trading groups, if you have any trading groups so that the newbies there, uh, ma-recommend po nila itong program na natin sa kanila yung itong program na ito. And they'll know that there's a program like this that's going to help them in their stock market journeys, especially sa mga newbies, okay? Emily Gultiano, good morning. Gandang aaga, sir. Good morning then. Jolly Gals, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Laika. Good morning then. Makian, hello, Sir Lloyd. Good morning. Morning to babe Claudette. Oy. Morning sa inyo. Paolo Drew, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Sean Lau, uh, good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. And Laika, BTC, sir. 13K na. Congratulations. Argel, hopefully meron ka investment sa Bitcoin. Mark Lizaso, good morning Sir Lloyd, bumagsak ang Costco, 6.56, 6.57, yung cut loss ko, ikat ko na ba sa opening pag nahit ang 6.57, Costco, let's check it out, yeah, I did, I did mention this yesterday, sadly, nag-drop siya, this is the, this is the, this is the hard thing about the market, it, not everything goes according to our plan. Um, dapat ito medyo antay natin yung isang confirmation niya pa. But anyways, uh, this is already here. Um, price range and drop ni Costco. Wala pa. Right? Um, 6.57 ang cut loss mo. That's just 2% away from the, um, from the major support. Um, divergence pa yan eh. Um, I would recommend if ever pumasok ka dito sa support na ito, the 3% below support is around um, 6.55. So, na-hit na yan. I'd recommend mga siguro give it until 4% uh, for for Costco. Um, divergence rin position niya. Though, nag-touch sa lower Bollinger Band. But, um, okay pa rin naman yung price niya. Hindi pa ganong bumabagsak talaga. Because we have another support right here. Which is just very near. Ito yung challenging pag ganito may support na malapit. I'd say move it to 4%. Um, but, uh, yung tolerance mo lang ha, iba-iba kasi tayo ng tolerance. Um, if ever kasi pumasok ka dito, the overall risk around is 5% pa lang. So, I, I can give this to 6%. So, mga 4%, if, I, I would give it 4%. If ever it really it still drops, I'll get out already. Kasi meron tayong major support dito and we're just hitting that line le, uh, recently. And dyan pa lang tayo sa linya na yan. Okay, that's for Costco. Um, John, Vincent Pleto, good morning Sir Lloyd. Any insights kay CA and CAB? Um, taas nito kahapon eh. Uh, I don't want to recommend it up there. Dapat napansin na natin tong volume spikes na ito eh. 
these uh, stocks really are na hype kasi ito eh. Um, I don't wanna recommend these stocks anymore. That's a missed opportunity. Hirap hulihin yan. Benson, uh, Mark Benson on ISM po. Sir Lord, is it good to add from yesterday's price? ISM, from yesterday's price, it cl- closed at 6.889. It really depends on your purpose in the stock. If you're trading it, I don't wanna recommend adding more right now. Um, we are at sell levels. Kaka- sell, sell area pa lang ito. Oh. So, I don't want to recommend buying more at sell levels. Let it pull back. Maybe it will pull back. If it if it does a pull back, then good. That's when you, that's when you, uh, what do you call this? That's when you buy more on the bounce. Or if you really want to go aggressive and add more, pwede kayo mag breakout entry if you want to. It's just that it's really hard pag andito sa taas. Nasa sell half levels tayo. Ako dyan, magsa-sell half na ako. Right? If I'm trading it. So, we're at sell levels as of the moment. I don't want to recommend buying more. Pag nag-breakout lang, at the very least, meron tayong sure na momentum na naman. Cyrus Perez, good morning, sir. Good to buy po ba yung M1? Let me double check my audio. Ito, okay lang pala. Um, good to buy po ba yung M1? Mustayin natin si M1. Um, nagda-downtrend pa ito. Inaabangan ko yung buy signal nito. Eh, diba? And si M1. Okay, so this is this is looking good for M1. Any bounce soon should be we should be testing this. Maganda to, maganda to ita si MY. This is a good company. Um, what I mean projects. Any bounce soon that should be confirming a support that should be good for MY. Um, pwede natin i-test yan aggressively si MY. Wait lang ng bounce. Regards kay Miss Apple and Tulaika Pabati sa mga dalaga ko. Angelica and Erica, nag-graduate si Erica kahapon with higher high honors. Proud mama here. Hi Emily. Um, hi to your daughter. Yeah, I saw your posts about the graduation. We um, congratulations, um, Erica and J Rosa di ba sa Davao kapo ngayon sa July 20 pa po ako magpupunta ng Davao. It's at July 20. So if you wanna join, um, meron po akong post about that na registration link. Just click on the registration link to register. Andun po yung ano? Andun po yung um what they call this, uh, program and schedules and registration instructions. Don Lucas Heiser, good morning, VUL, MHC, pa shout out sa kapatid ko na si Divina, hi Divina, at sa pamangking si Bettina, Divina and Bettina, na kino- kinood ng daily grind today. Good morning sa inyo. Right, um, VUL, Vulcan, Vulcan, pasensya na kids, I don't think you can relate to these, uh, but I hope you will be anytime soon once you are already starting to manage your finances. Si Vulcan, nag-confirm pa rin ng um, breakout yan. Um, actually, yung breakout ni Vulcan na inaapangan natin was here, right? Ito yung downtrend and we were waiting for the uh, um, for, for that breakout. Actually, MA20 magic. Look at that yellow line. Uh, one of my favorite lines out there. Diba? Um, ang ganda ng ano. Uh, it's confirming as a support. I don't want to get in aggressively on that. Pag may green lang, that's when we try to enter uh, Vulcan. MHC. Si MHC naman. And so MHC is one of my recommendations for today. We can test it out again. Um, possibly, this is already good price action. Mas higher na ang ano niya, mas higher na ang buying niya. And it spiked yesterday, so that's a good sign for MHC. Pwede na natin testing in. Emily Gulchano, mayroon pa sana akong $80 kay BTC Sir. Kaso nung bumaba, bigla, um, bigla nitong bum- umaga, binenta ko. Tapos ngayon, tumaas na naman. <laughs> that's, uh, that's part of trading Emily. Uh, minsan hindi, hindi naman natin mauhuli lahat that's why it's important we sell half lang muna just in case na um, just in case na umakyat pa siya and then just plan ahead for the entire exit um, Amer Dom Biz hi good morning sir 100k uh, na si Bitcoin forecast by 2020 right um, yeah um, I think that's the that's the f- where the future is headed um, si Bitcoin I just can't um I just can't predict a hundred case. Just a recommendation lang ng mga nagfa follow ng Bitcoin. Right? Amer Dombiz, um Angelo Obdianella, IRC and Max or Lloyd. Um use about sa Bitcoin I still recommend. Yes, um those has um may facts naman because somehow um 
industries are now embracing the cryptocurrency, uh, the blockchain industry, uh, the blockchain technology. So there's a big possibility for Bitcoin um, going up. But I will always, uh, I will, I will always say, only risk. Everything is speculative, but in sa Bitcoin, only risk an amount you are you can afford to lose. Okay, and be responsible with your entries. Uh, po kayo magpapa FOMO. Okay, Angelo Obdianella, IRC and Maxer Lloyd. Yun yung para in case na malit kayo. Um, planado nyo naman yung exit nyo, and hindi kayo masasaktan. Marami pong na, um, marami pong na na um, na depressed din sa Bitcoin mga pumasok sa 15k last time and umabot sa 19k. Ganoon din yung hype nila. And everything is familiar. It's really hard to enter a stock when it's making noises already. So I don't like to enter those kinds of position. IRC um volume still picking up. Um okay pa rin naman si IRC just by as long as the support holds. Meron tayong um wala pa tayong solid green talaga. I would say wait for the solid green. Hopefully that will happen. If that happens, that just confirm this consolidation support right here. <clears throat> so IRC, pwede, pwede pang ano? Pwede pang hintay lang muna sa glit. Um, asa na ako? Biglang bumaba yung comments. Um, IRC and Mac from Angelo and si Mac naman M A C. Um, Macro Asia. Alright, si Mac na pull back. That's good, right? I did recommend Mac here, umakyat siya, and then nagpo pull back na. That's supposed to be, uh, that's to be expected. Any bounce soon should be okay for Mac. Antay natin yung bounce si Mac, and we'll, uh, we should be able to, um, we should be able to test it again. As of the moment, wala pa tayong bounce, so ingat lang muna. Yoni Pioca, good morning. Bull and Bear, good day, coach. Good morning then. Gehien Penyaloga, morning, Sir Lloyd. P H A M P I. Thanks. P H A. Si P H A. Meron pa rin support dyan. Just keep buying the support. Buy as long as the support holds. Ayun yung recommendation ko sa PHA. MPI. Sa MPI, nagpo-pull back pa. Antayin lang natin yung second. Tingnan nyo po yung pattern. Okay? So, it's gonna... Uh, this is the pattern of the stock movement. Right? So, it's starting to go drop again. We'll, we'll wait for the bounce before we enter. We, en we want to enter MPI. So, ingat lang muna. Jawa umaga. Good morning po. Pa-shoutout po kay... Mara at Isabel sa Brazil. Nanonood po sila ngayon. Good morning po sa inyo dyan. Wilcon and Nickel po. Wilcon. Obrigado. Uh, Wilcon. Nag-breakout si Wilcon eh. I just wanna make a uh, wait for confirmation ngayon kay Wilcon. Another green that will sustain the breakout. Pwede po natin pasukin yan. Breakout strategy for Wilcon. Okay. Very bullish stock. Amazing. Alright. So, Wilcon. Um, nag breakout siya. Pwede na yan actually. Um, but I just wanna wait for one more green before I wanna enter it. Um, just for, I know, just for, just to be safe. See, si Nickel, we talked about this. Uh, Nickel, I, uh, I recommended Nickel at this level, at the support. Now we are at resistance levels. This is why you should respect resistances. Wag po tayong papasok dyan sa resistance, okay? Because it's down to, bound to do a pullback. And possible pullback na ito. Next bounce will be a good um, entry point. Ant Antayin lang natin anong gagawin ni, ni, ni Nickel. So, for now, wala pa muna. Nawal Taranko, good uh, coach. Pasuyo po ng PNB. Alright, Philippine National Bank. Alright, so PNB. Alright, so PNB is doing okay. Alright, this is the bounce we're waiting for. Mag maganda naman yung ano niya. Maganda niya yung pinapakita niyang bounce. I'd say, yeah, you can test out PNB. Use this area as your support, okay? Gamitin nyo po yung area niyan as support for PNB if you wanna test it out. Um, any green soon should be okay for PNB. Let's see if ever, ano, let's see if ever um, umakit siya. Uh, this, this stock is a good stock. Uh, good company. Yung nga lang, may downturn lang tayo. Yun lang pinag-iingatan natin. But then again, we're seeing stabilization at this area already. Medyo mahirap ito eh. We're, work, we're, we're working against a downtrend. Wala akong mahanap na solid support talaga for PNB. Pero, price action eh. Hindi natin, I, don't, I don't want to be aggressive in PNB. Um, mahirap nito eh. Pag andito, I'd say wait, ah, uh, this is an engulfing pattern kasi this is one of my trading setups na inaantay. Yeah, um, 
I'd say uh, test by lang dito. Konti lang na pera, okay? Just to test out if ever aggressive entries should would work. If not, cut loss here. Uh, for conservative entry, um, best is a breakout lang. Right? From that downtrend, ang entry ni PNB. Aggressively, I'd say it's already okay. Test by no, with small amount lang muna. Jao, umagap. Uh, no, uh, that was from Noel Taranco. Ido Almo, thank you so much po for the, ano, for the donation, right? Where, that's gonna be a very big help. Right. Um, jo John Vincent Pleto, sir, any debit card, MasterCard naman po pwede gamitin para mag-cash in sa eToro. E yes, that definitely. Uh, usually, um, um, debit cards are okay. Okay? Uh, pwede nyo pong gamitin niya for deposit and then if you need to withdraw, mawi-withdraw nyo rin po dyan. Dominic Corpus, good morning, Sir Lloyd. BTC, gumagawa ng correction. Sino ang birthday dyan? Libre nyo na, Sir Lloyd. Thanks for to Fed Powell, it holds cut rates. Dapat may mag-donate ng Jollibee kay Sir Lloyd. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, um, ang ganda ng ano, ang ganda ng news sa uh, international market. Yung Fed hindi nag ano nag raise ng uh, high, uh, nag ano ano nila ng rates. So that's gonna be good for the stock market. So we're expecting the stock market of the international market to go good. Um, si XRP. Negative ito ngayon, pero only it na lang yan because I've been selling X XRP at around 6% gain. So, congratulations sa mga nag-copy trade sa atin. Medyo tagilid tayo this month. Ang tagal gumalaw ng mga positions ko. So, medyo malas yung mga napasukan kong stocks. Tagal gumalaw. <laughs> um, but anyways, uh, we're looking for um, an, uh, future entries uh, with, the, ano, with, the, with the good news sa international market. So, we'll be able to... Kaya natin bawiin yan. Kaya yan, syempre. It's just that malas, um, not my month. Uh, it's a roll cab. Uh, pala, speaking of um, international market, guys, you can trade international market. Ang ganda mag trade sa international market. Uh, mainly because the volume in the international market is very good. Um, that's why yung mga trading setups usually happen. Okay? Um, trade the international market, test it out. Or if ever wala kayong oras and you really can't trade, um, Copy someone. You can always do copy trading here in eToro. That's the beauty of this platform. Um, you can always look for a person. And then if you think his performance is good, then try to copy him. Um, just uh, just put an amount and then siya po mag-trade para sa inyo. Diba? That's very convenient for everyone. Um, yun, yun lang. Please use my link for that so that future promotions ni eToro uh, with me makasali po kayo. Please use my link when you create an eToro account. Make sure you do that. Don't go to eToro.com directly, right? Um, tulad ngayon, there's a there's a promotion for eToro for those people who created an account using my link April 30 and before, right? Yung mga nasa May na nagawa, sadly hindi na tayo kasali. But April 30 and then earlier than that, na hindi pa mga nag, naglo-load up ng account, if you load up at least $200, you will receive $50 extra uh, bonus ni Itoro yan sa atin. Um, there are, Itoro gave me a list. I already sent an email to the list. It's ar at around 2,600 people. So if ever, you, all of those who created the account will fund. That means Itoro is gonna be giving us 6 point plus million pesos. Right? That's a lot for everyone. Right? Just for investing. Diba? Six, six million pesos shared to everyone who created the account na hindi pa naglo-load. So, grab that opportunity. Yung $50 na yan, you do whatever you wanna do with it after. Right? You wanna withdraw it, may withdrawal charge na $25, but the very least, $25 gain pa rin. Diba? <laughs> so, doing nothing. Just loading up and then you withdraw it after. So, you're, you're st you still gain. Right? Check it out. Right? Create an account using my link lang. Um, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Pa shout out to Marvin Bus uh, Bus Tanera from Saudi. Bagong recruit ko to join stock market. Good morning, Marvin. Good morning, Rusty. Um, welcome to the stock market. Jew Peter Sebastian. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Please go sa Green and DD. Let's check out Green and DD. Green. Alright, si Green naman. Uh, we talked about this, uh, one of my picks yesterday. Diba si Green? Was that yesterday? I forgot. Um, hindi pa siyang gumagalaw. But still okay. Still okay to buy si Green. 
um, that's still buy overall nakapaka uh, we're at we're playing at support levels as much as possible get in near here before uh, okay green um dd si dd kamusta natin so nagpo pull back pa si B dd Bollinger Band is starting to constrict, meaning mag-stabilize ito. Let's see if it will create a support anytime soon. Pag nag-create ng support yan, yeah, we can we can get in. Dominic Corpus, bili lang ng bili na po ng ISM para i-push natin sa new trend. <laughs> yeah, uh, for investors, I definitely will recommend ISM for long term. Right? Yung ISM na hawak ko ngayon is for long term. Hindi ko na po chinochupit yan. Pinabayaan ko na lang. And it's been growing, right? Uh, Tony May tra tra vlog, Travel Vlog, Sir, what sure take and CA and CAB? Hype lang ba ito? Yeah, it usually happens when CA. Ilang beses na yung nangyayari kay CA. Maakit ng ganyan and then nawawala rin na naman. It's really hard to say. But then again, we can test it out. Wait lang na pull back and then bounce. And then we can test it. Kaya sa ito, nag-bounce ito noon sa MA20. Okay not, di ba? But right now, it's too high. Don't wanna recommend that. Meg, Sir, from Sin Lord. Um, Meg naman, yes. Um, we're still at MA20. There's a big volume at that MA20 level, so that's good. Um, problem ko nito is napakalapit ng resistance. A good, rec uh, a good signal for Meg would be, uh, what do you call this? A, a breakout na for now. So, antay lang tayo ng breakout kay Meg. Um, sino pa ba? Angelo Objanela, salamat, you're welcome. Reynold pa Poblacion, good morning, Sir Lloyd. House, please, thanks. Let's check out house. Ayan, si House nag-clip na sa lower Bollinger Band So I think bababa pa ito si House So wag muna ngayon, ingat na muna uh, No need to be aggressive in this stock Because it's already too high Diba? Siya tumataas na po yan um, Wala pong forever na up na uptrend Good morning Sir Lloyd FLOI was on fire yesterday Definitely, right? Uh, look at FLI, the magic of MA20 This is why I always wanna test out MA20 Right, we talked about this get in at MA20, di ba, ilang araw. And then there it is. It suddenly spiked up with spiked volume. The trend is your friend. Ayan, and congratulations sa mga naghawak ng FLI. Pa-burger naman kayo. Ang ganda ng akyat na FLI ka po. Amazing. Emerald, hi sir. If sa, isa, if sa PSEI 8K ang minimum na deposit ah, na, da, na dapat ibili para di lugi, how about po sa eToro? Thanks much. Sa eToro, Depende kasi yan sa purpose ninyo. Actually, sa PSEI, even 5K is enough. Um, but for tri uh, if you're investing, but if you're trading, mahirap po yan. Don't worry about, don't worry about eToro kasi nakakalculate yung charges na yan for copy trading. If you're just copy trading, it's considered as investing. Wala kayong, wala kayong dapat isipin dyan. Um, if you wanna trade in eToro, siguro, yeah, um, around s similar to that levels. Actually, kasi mas, kasi mas if you're just gonna be trading stocks, mas malaki, uh, mas mura si Itoro ng charges compared dito sa Pilipinas. Um, sa Philippines point, mas ang alam ko sa Itoro kasi sa balikan for um selling and buying point eighteen percent ah po ang total, right? Ah, uh, si PSE forgot how much. Um, can you please post magkano yung kay PSE um, from buying and selling and then you add it up magkano yung percentage. Um, Salon News tayo kay ISM. Bili na pa presyong Chupitero. <laughs> John Vincent Leto, ang bilis ng processing sa eToro. Kaka-cash in lang pasok agad using debit card ha. Thanks Sir Lloyd. Antay na lang yung 50 dollars. Yes. Um, congratulations once you receive it. BSC Sir at SSC from this is from OFW Trader BSC. Um, nagkiklip sa lower Bollinger Bands eh. so um, kind of shaky for me um, the support is medyo right so historically kasi si BSP I mean si BSC dito yung pinaka malaking resistance niya so I'm kind of shaky with the position right now but then again if it con if it recovers and confirms the support why not meron tayong support dito nagka sell off kahapon pero bumalik rin naman kaagad for BSC. So, it's really hard to tell right now. Nakakatakot yung price action niya. Um, SSP, volume is starting to slope up. This is good for SSP. We have a support right here. Um, check out the support if you want to. Pag may green yan today, test it out. Just make sure you follow your cut loss, okay? Kasi, ito, first quarter ni uh, SSP, medyo mabigat yung negative niya. Um, that might 
that might pull the stock even further down but nag-clip naman siya sa upper ball ng Shaban so it's a mixed ano I'm just basing this most purely on um technical analysis lang um price action wise maganda naman pag nag-green yan test nyo po at least you are playing at support levels hopefully mag-sustain yan that's a very solid support right here for SSP so hopefully mag magangat na um Aris de la Peña good morning po web Ito si Web mahirap ni kasi medyo mataas na si Web. Eh. Really hard to tell. But then again, MA20 has been working well for Web. We are nearing resistance. Our support and we our risk to reward ratio is not worth it. So if ever hindi pa kayo nakapasok na Web, I don't want to recommend it. Maybe here at support again or breakout na lang should you really want to enter Web. At least may base po kayo. Uh, Maria, Christina, Nicoleta, sir, okay na po ba 50k pesos starting in Toro? Yes, definitely. That's a very good start. Especially if you want to trade the international market. Um, amazingly, si Apple is um, trading on her own. Right? Nag-trade na siya ang sarili niya. Mas malaki pa kita niya sa akin this month. Right? So, she's doing well. Um, chupit-chupit lang ang ginagawa niya. 1%, 2% gains. Minibenta niya kaagad, tapos hanap na naman ibang position. Kasi ang kagandaan sa ituro, ang dami mong pwedeng pasukin ng magagandang stocks, international companies, pwede mong pasukin. So, I'm just, um, I'm observing her uh, strategy. It's been working, right? Chupit-chupit lang. So, most probably, that is gonna be good for ituro also. Why not? Wealth Gainer, um, Good morning, Coach. Good morning then Monet Lagman. Good morning, MRC and SCC. Si MRC, I told you guys noon sa support, pumasok na kayo and it's already starting. Uh, should you really want to enter now, pwedeng breakout, but it's already a riskier. The higher the position, the riskier it is. Ilang beses ko ito na-recommend dito. It's already going up. Good spike of the volume yesterday. So most probably the uh, breakouts gonna be continuing. So MRC, pwede yan today, right? At least nag-breakout siya. Just cut, make sure you have plans on your cut loss, okay? For MRC. Congratulations sa mga pumasok kay MRC noon when I recommended it. SEC naman, maakit na. Nag-breakout siya kahapon. Another breakout strategy for SEC. Test it out. Yung nga lang, medyo manipis yung volume niya pa rin. Uh, so, I really can't recommend this. But then again, there's that breakout strategy. Why not? Diba mo net? Ekiel, 1.19 po. Total charge sa PSE. Right? I'm using fill stocks. Yes, totoo yan. 1.19% sa total charge sa PSE. Mas mura pa po si eToro. If you wanna check out eToro's, um, uh, what do you call this? Uh, charges, uh, market hours and fees for stocks. Makita nyo po dito. That's how you look for it. Uh, let's go for stocks. Right? Here it is. So, so stocks. Um, nasulat ba to? Uh, for stock investing. Right. Buy position. Nah, this is for ano. Right. Ito. Uh, may also trade stocks. Uh, these trades incur a fee called a spread. 0.09% for either side. Buy and sell. So, if you add that um over um if you add that 0.18 po 0.18 lang sa PSE i mean sa sa inter uh, sa eToro so mas mura po siya kaysa sa PSE thanks for that ano thanks for that Ekiel OFW trader salamat you're welcome Regal Mantak good, good sir ATN po good morning ATN um ATN so stop it's consolidating at this area right now. Remember, we recommended ATN here. Um, it's doing a pullback. Hopefully, it gives us a pullback and a good bounce. Kapag ganito, mahirap eh. Um, break out ang pwede natin entry dito. For now, wala pa po tayong buy signal for ATN. Let's see what will happen in the future. For sure, uh, um, ano, uh, for sure, uh, we'll be, uh, we'll be checking it out in the future. Um, Fe Avelino, good morning, Sir Lloyd. MBT, JFC po. MBT, let's check it out. MBT. It's MBT, bumababa pa. So, antay na naman tayo. Mag-bounce yan. We recommended MBT here sa baba. Uh, the breakout even, ba? And then, umakyat siya. Kaso nga lang, nag-fail na naman ngayon. MBT, let's see. In the future, pag may bounce, pwede po natin pasukin yan. Um, good morning, Sir. Cut loss na po ba kay Google? Um, hindi pa. Uh, Si Google Alphabet, actually, hindi pa. Um, depende kung saan ka pumasok. Um, I entered Google here at the start of the 
climbed ni Google. So I'm still positive in Google. Nagpo-pull back lang siya. Um, I'm just waiting for it to bounce again. Si Google ko, let's go to my portfolio. Um, si Google, I'm still up to 45%. I still think it's gonna go up anytime soon. So, hindi pa ako na to take profits kay Google. I think it's still gonna go up. Mura pa po si Google considering the price action niya. Okay? Kaka-breakout niya lang sa MA20. Uh, so, this stock is most probably gonna be starting an uptrend. That's why I'm holding on to my Google position. Um, di pa po siya cut loss actually for me. Depende on your position. Um, may I ask where did you enter? <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, sorry about that. <coughs> okay, um going back, depende po 'yan sa <coughs> position ninyo si Google, okay? Um dito kasi ako sa simula ng um climb niya pumasok kaya I'm, I'm still positive in, in in Google. Um Brent's Agonia, Sir Lloyd Pasilip MPI, thank you. MPI Kumusta na si MPI? Hindi ko nakakamusta si MPI. Ayun. Um, Uh, we already talked about this. Dinaanan na natin yan. Wait na lang tayo ng next na pullback bounce before we wanna test MPI again. Okay? Um, feedback for EEI from Hiang. Asyadong ang taas na si EEI. Recommended EEI and the ME20 bounce. Um, ay, kaya pala kasi nag-breakout si EEI. Um, actually, no. I don't really consider this a breakout. This is the trend line of uh, of EEI. Uh, I will recommend wait for the next pullback po for EEI. Pullback po ang laro natin dyan kasi nasa taas na. Right? This stock is on an uptrend. Your support and resistance niya pataas din. Look at that. MA20. The magic of MA20. Always wait for this position. And then test it out. Doesn't mean kasi na aakit yan. But that's usually where the stock goes up. And the beauty about this is You are very you are very near the support. ME20. That's why I love ME20. I I am aggressive with ME20 here in PSE. It always usually works out. Uh, tulad nila GFC, even the blue chips. It it happens in blue chips. Look at this. ME20, 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 ME20 bounces. So many ME20 bounces. Uh, that's why I love ME20. Speaking of GFC, guys, malapit na mag-breakout si GFC. Abangan ang breakout. Pag nag-breakout yan, pasukin yun na po. Okay? Um naabangan ko lang ang ano, inaabangan ko lang ang uh, what do you call this? Um ano niya, ang entry niya. So there's a uh, there's a question right here. Very good question. I've been looking at this from Reggie Ortiz. Uh, good morning Sir Lloyd. Comments on FB Libra po. One of the reason why Bitcoin BTC USD open natin yung chart ni BTC ha. BTC USD. One of the reason why BTC has been climbing is the announcement of Facebook uh, releasing Libra. Right? Kasi sa, sa, sa cryptocurrency world, if you want to trade crypto talaga, you use Bitcoin to buy other you you use Bitcoin to buy other cryptos. That's the beauty of eToro, by the way. Kasi sa eToro, pwede ka diretso yung pera mo, ibili mo ng Ethereum or um, XRP In the crypto trading talaga is you buy Bitcoin first and you use your Bitcoin to buy other uh, other other coins, right? Yun yung practice talaga. That's why Bitcoin is going up. It's because most people are gonna be using their Bitcoin to buy crypto. Diba? I mean, to buy Libra, possibly to buy Libra. Why is it going up? It's because the move of Facebook na gagawa sila ng cryptocurrency nila is... gonna be a big statement for the crypto, right? It's a big statement because Facebook is a trusted brand. Halos lahat ng tao may Facebook. Majority of online people have Facebook. And if Facebook creates Bitcoin, that validates, I'm not Bitcoin, uh, creates Libra, and it's their cryptocurrency. That validates that cryptocurrency is gonna be accepted. It's the way to go for the future, Right? That is why people are getting interested in crypto again because of that. That's why the sudden surge lately because of Libra. Now, may difference si, Bit, uh, si Bitcoin at si Libra. Ang gusto ko kay Libra is it's much more regulated. Mas regulated siya ngayon. Right? Ang problema kasi ni Bitcoin, the downside of Bitcoin was 
especially for businesses and yung mga traditional people is the lack of uh, the lack of um, centralization of it diba? which is also an advantage for Bitcoin basically that's the purpose of Bitcoin lack of decentralization but uh, without without kasi without what they call this without monitoring of the money comes oh, with that power of freedom we know that sobra namang freedom is can can, can be abused kaya po ginagamit siya for uh, mga nakikita niyo po mga, mga balita ginagamit ng mga criminals for money laundering etc marami po kasi it's untraceable basically so at the very least we still it's still needed that centralization is needed but this time at the very least for tracking na ng money where is it coming from um, etc this is much better for me right because <clears throat> i am i am really focused on the in, uh, for in the financials if you know right pag nanakawan ka at the very least ma- na trace pa yung may money trail pa na madali i trace diba sa so, sa bitcoin ang hirap na ng money trace though everything is tabulated but tracing the money is really hard because anyone can create their account diba here in facebook the very least is gonna be a link to an account most probably it will so to a public public profile mas merong mas merong clear money trails ngayon that's why um i would say i will follow libra even more maybe use it in future businesses why not diba kasi may transaction ako sir lloyd bili ako ng ganito okay facebook na lang tayo libre libra na lang pambayad no need for no need na magpera padala kasi may bayad pang pera padala diba that's advantage of crypto basically guys sending money mas lesser na lang ang ano mas mas lesser hassle and mas mas ano mas mas maganda yung, um, yung money trail and this time it's linked to accounts in Facebook much better for me okay especially for people who are doing businesses talaga so it's gonna be good I'm uh, inaabangan ko po yan maybe integrate it in future projects Reggie Ortiz um, <clears throat> that's my two cents in uh, Libra Elvia Aquino good morning Sir Lloyd <clears throat> MRC RWM MRC, we talked about MRC already. Pwede yung breakout. RWM, ito yung nirecommend ko the past few days, di ba, sa RWM. Nagpo-pullback na. Ganda ng spike. Eh. We recommended it here. And umangat na po siya for three days. Nagpo-pullback. Let's wait for the bounce. Pag nag-bounce yan, definitely enter it again. Okay? That is a higher high. We're waiting for the higher low for our entry point. Si LR naman, nagko-consolidate. Yeah, I think this is good for LR nagra-rounded bottom na siya right um test out LR use uh, bias lungs that support holds for M- LR that's a good company right there si Mac naman um Mac nagpo-pull back let's see if it will bounce anytime soon and give us an entry so for now wala pa Annie one of my favorite picks for today we'll discuss more about the position later uh when I discuss my picks for Annie that but definitely my favorite pick for today is Annie ECP, yan si ECP, bias lang the support holds as um, hindi natin alam saan ito pupunta. Guys, remember that? Hindi natin alam saan papunta si, si stock market. But we have a support and our our system says the supports are where the stocks start to go up. So, most probably it's gonna go up. And we try to bet on that. We don't know for sure, but we're betting on this. The good thing about this is it's very low risk. It's just one percent, one point seven percent away from support, meaning yung cut loss niya around five percent. So that's very viable, very low risk position. We have to lower our risk as, as much as possible when it comes to trading. So pwede natin test yan si ECP. Renata do maayong buntag sir Lloyd. Buy na ba si Primex? Yes, Primex is in one of my recommendations for today. Hello JR. Um, sir Lloyd, how about the fifty percent increase of CAB yesterday? Uh, more power up to you guys um, momentum trading tayo dyan if may ingit kayo dyan make sure you know how to play with it there is money to be made in it in momentum trading baka magtuloy yung momentum niya di ba so um, pwede kayo mag momentum trade dyan but only if you know how to momentum trade if not huwag nyo na pong pakialaman yan Roger Roger da, da J da hi da J tuloy tuloy coach pahinga din Good morning, insights. 
<laughs> hey, one of these days, um, uh, anyways, I'm gonna go to um Davao the next um coming days. So, makapagpahinga ako doon. Um, maybe visit a few places and do the seminar. So, wala tayong daily grind. Most probably for maybe 2 to 3 days lang. So, makapagpahinga naman ako. Right? Rest when I can. But whenever I can um do the daily grind, why not? Diba? Um, I love doing this. Uh, somehow, it's my day is not complete if I cannot do daily grind anymore. So, med- parang ito na yung trabaho ko. <laughs> um, Reynold, uh, yun, um, Insights for Green and PHA. Bias lang sa support holds for green. And then si PHA, keep buying the dips lang. Masyad, mura pa yan si PHA. Right. Reynold Poblacion, Sir Lloyd, ask ko lang anong chart platform gamit mo for international market. I use this um, one. Uh, it's in uh, tradingview.com. Marami pa pong iba dyan, but somehow, so far, yun yung ginagamit ko. Gerald Esparis, good day. Joseph Fernandez, hi sir, how about web and SSI? Si web, um, not worth it to enter for now. Maybe breakout or if it goes back to support, pwede natin i-testing. Uh, si SSI naman, um, syadong mataas na for me si SSI. Nag-umabot siya ng highest niya the past few day, uh, 52 week high. Uh, yesterday, but you see, there's already sell-off at those levels. Best to enter near MA20. Nag-bounce ka agad siya nung bumaba siya malapit sa MA20. Uh, that would be the best entry point for SSI as of the moment. So hopefully, lumapit dyan. If hindi kayo makapasok dyan, huwag niyo na pong pipilitin. Rod, J. Dahay, magkaroon po ba ng ICO si Libra if ever ma-implement? Most probably, yes. Definitely. Uh, Rian Garcia, pacheck po ng or thanks. Right. Time check is 8.58. At around 9, we're gonna start with my recommendations. Um, si Or, ganda ng movement ni Or eh. Right? Um, we have a support right here. Try to get in near the support kay Or as much as possible. We have possible resistances here kasi malapit na. Um, get in near support as much as you can for Or. Um, Arjul Mendoza, sir, pag nag-copy ba sa inyo, kailangan po ba i-check din yung open trades? Um, yes, I will recommend checking open trades because I think those positions are still gonna go up. Uh, that's why I'm holding them. So, just click on open trades. Um, copy open trades. Blake, Adia, Adia, um, Mac, and DD, sir. Um, do, I think we already went to this. Si Mac, antay lang ng bounce. Si Didi, um, medyo shaky pa yung position niya pababa pa. So, iwas lang muna. Hopefully, mag-bounce si Didi soon. Right? Sir, best time to copy your trade in eToro. Um, anytime. Ezekiel, sir. Good morning po. Picor po. Right. Um, 8.59. It's Picor. Meron siyang support dito at around this area. Pag nag-green yan, that's a confirmation of the support. You wanna test it out? Yes, definitely at that level. Napakamura pa po ni Picor ngayon. Um, antay lang ng green. DD, we just talked about that. Yan ni Pioca. Um, anong maganda entry sa BTC? Um, FOMO levels na po ito. I don't wanna recommend that anymore unless you're an investor. Okay? Um, best entry level for for now is a pullback. I think magpapahinga pa to si BTC. Um, pull back and then bounce will be the best entry point for BTC. If does if doesn't give us that position, then don't enter it. Okay. Um, unless investor po kayo, right? Be sure what your purpose is. If your if your purpose is to trade it right now, there's no trading position for it. Investors ang nagpapaangat yan ni BTC for now. Pwede mong i momentum trade yan. Um, but you have to follow it every day. Vincent Villegas, good morning coach. How much leverage do you use when trading Forex, CFDs, and eToro? Times 2 lang po ang pinakamataas na ginagamit ko. Right? Because um, times 3, uh, times 5 is too aggressive for me. Um, I have to be responsible with my trades kasi uh, there are many people copying me so I don't have to be, I don't want to be aggressive in my trading. Right? Times 2 lang pinakamataas ginagamit ko. Vincent Villegas, you're welcome. Okay, so I'm gonna go now to my picks let me go full screen on my chart so here are my picks for today unang una paborito ko po si ani right i'm going to be recommending ani for today volume is already going up you will see that spike in the volume uh, right there diba kita niyo po yan and sideways po siya and already broke ma20 that's a good signal for uh, ani bodega na po yan um, bilhin nyo na po si Ani habang mababa pa yan okay? Alco kasi wala na nagbebenta ni Ani 
Um, Alco, I'm recommending Alco for today. Uh, this is, uh, this did a, uh, an uptrend after this breakout from this resistance. After na po siya, this is the good, a good pullback and this is the bounce we're waiting for for Alco. Definitely buy it. We recommended Alco here. The support now, it's already going up. Um, pullback and bounce to enter for Alco. Um, MHC, recommending MHC for today. We may good price action na po tayo. So, test it out. Uh, PSB, si PSB for today. Why? Nag-breakout po siya on this very strong resistance. And then, there's a good volume on that breakout. I think this is gonna sustain today. Pag nag-sustain yan, <coughs> another green, enter it for PSB. Um, use this resistance as your support. Hopefully, you already know how to trade breakouts. If not yet, I have a video about breakouts. Please search for it. Primex and CLI. Si Primex um, confirmed the support. Yes, I'm going to be recommending Primex. Overall, it's still very cheap. And then CLI. Si Bulan Masters, we're waiting for another entry point for CLI. I think this is good. Norman Garcia, pa shout out po sa Life Community, Rome, Italy, League of Investors and Filipino Entrepreneurs. Tulog na tulog sila. Ako work pa. Good morning po sa inyo dyan. Alright, um, speaking of Rome, Italy, guys, I'll be in Rome. Shout out to Life Community. I hope I can see you there um, and support the event. Uh, it's gonna be on August 4 sa Rome, Italy. I'm gonna be posting more details about it this week. Um, Naanday ko lang yung go talaga ni Itoro as our sponsor so that we can make the seminars as cheap as we can, as as, as affordable as we can. Diba? Um, it's, ang importante naman kasi dyan is the learning. Okay, CLI, uh, recommending it for today. Bounce on the support, good volume spike on the bounce. So this is good for uh, Sibulan Masters. Nasa support po tayo, just cut loss below that if ever mali tayo. Um, okay ba ba pasukin si FLI ngayon, sir? I don't want to recommend it. Wait for the pullback again. Mark Aaron Rayo. Um, so those are my picks for today. Um, so far, wala namang, ano, wala namang comments uh, from others. Um, I want to remind you guys, July 20, sa mga anjan po sa, ano, anjan po sa Davao, July 20, guys. Um, check this out. This is a very good, this is a very good program for, for us. Especially to your friends. If nangihi, na, nahihirapan po kayo sa finances ninyo. Alright, I want to share this event, the key to financial freedom. Alright. Events, events, events. Right, sorry, sorry about that. Okay. Okay, so here. So the key to financial freedom, July twenty. Dalawang session po ito, morning session and the afternoon session. Uh, the morning session is about financial literacy. Um, I'm gonna teach you, especially if gusto niyo po matuto how to manage your finances well. The morning session is going to be very good for you. Ito po yung topic, topics natin for the morning session. What is financial freedom? Mastering your cash flow. Very important for financial freedom. Uh, responsible investing. Um, and then, ano paano ba mag-invest? Ano ba dapat pasukin ko at this point of my finances? Saan ba tayo dapat pumapasok? Right? And explaining the best available investments for the Filipinos. How to get rich in the stock market. Uh, passive income to eToro, VULs, bonds, real estate, cooperatives. Where I'm going to share to you the best areas to put your money in. This is where I'm putting my money in also. right? And that's for the morning session. This is going to be helpful for you. This is going to be transforming how you handle your finances and where you place your money. Then in the afternoon session is the trading masterclass. That's a separate session. Trading masterclass po. The event is only 500. Napakamura po niyan. Um, uh, what do you call this? Um, thanks to Itoro for making this available for us at this very rate. Okay, take advantage of this. Invite your friends from if you have friends in Davao, you can join the morning session for the financial literacy. Uh, that's gonna be a very good session for you guys. It was a very fruitful session here in Cebu, and we're bringing it to Davao. Okay, um, also, um, in the afternoon, yeah, trading masterclass. August 4, Rome, Italy. Well, we're going to be posting more about it. Let me see if you ha there are, we have comments pa kasi medyo maaga pa naman. Um, Ezekiel, um, okay pa ba pasukin si CPG and 7 ngayon? Uh, si 7-11, masyado mataas na po si 7. 
nagpo-pull back pa siya. I remember, I remember, I still remember recommending 7 here in this area. Anyways, um, 7 is too high. CPG, CPG nagsusupport po. If you can get in air at support, yan, magpila lang po kayo ng entry dyan at 0.58. That will be the best entry point for CPG. If you want to come in, come in. Ariel Clemente, Coach Ayon po. On more power. Thanks, you're welcome. Um, thank you then. Ayon. Si Ayon, maganda na yung volume spikes niya. Um, have hopefully you can still get in sa support kay Ionix, right? We are playing at resistance levels. I'm not sure if it's just gonna go up. If it goes up, wag niyo na po habulin. Wait for the pullback na lang. Get in your support as much as you can. Um, Sir STN magsi baka Sir STN baka magsiling ngayon o oh, how do we know bakit magsisiling yan we don't really know if sino magsisiling ngayon right no one can predict the market asking 30k po deposit ko sana kay Itoro from PayPal at copy kita kikita kaya ako monthly sa ganito kaliit na starting di po ba lugin charges ng withdrawals fees for Itoro PayPal um, 30k is an FT amount Think long term po. If you try to copy trade, you are gonna be doing long term as much as possible. Think long term. Wag nyo po isipin yung charges and withdrawals, right? For for that, those kinds of amounts at thirty k, right? Long term po yan. If ever you're looking for short term gains, um, I will. Ang hirap eh. Ang hirap lang ano sa stock market. If you really, if you're looking for short term trades, you really have to learn how to trade. Okay. Um, long term gains, um, medyo mid to long term gains po dapat for, for, for itoro for those amounts. Unless malaki po yung pera ninyo, if malaki po yung pera ninyo, kahit po mag gain lang kayo ng 5%, ang laki na niyan, pwede nyo i-withdraw, di ba? Um, kasi 25 dollars lang naman yung withdraw. Well, if malaki ang pera ninyo, then doesn't, kahit na 5% lang gain ninyo, ang laki na yan. And the uh, the gains are gonna be covering for the withdrawal charges. Dugs de Guzman, magkakaroon po ba kayo ng masterclass sa Manila? Thank God, we're playing, uh, we're planning on uh, for Manila soon. Most probably September, hopefully. Okay, um, I look for a sponsor for that para mag maging mura. Okay, awag lang sa kapa. <laughs> right, so ayan na naman yung mga uh, investments. Sir, sir, pa niyo mabul chart ni Ma. Si Ma, siya dong mataas yan. For now, si Ma. I want to recommend it. The um, masyado mataas pa yung akyat niya. Uh, we are nearing resistance level, so not worth it. Good morning, sir. May magtanong sa akin kung ka kailan at saan ang seminar sa Davao. Um, there's a post in Financial Freedom 101. Just go to the events. Nakapin naka din po yan. Um, also, kailan? It's August 20. Uh, saan? It's at Seda Hotel. So, shall po ang naging sponsor natin, si Itoro. Kaya kaya po natin, Seda Hotel. At that, 500 pesos, di ba? Seda Hotel. Why not? <laughs> Iris Senda, pakilagay po sa chat. Right, this is the registration for the event. Right, so this is the event. Uh, here. Ayan po. Um, sir? Kit Anticas SM sing buka hapon ko yung ni mo si Miss Apple. Yes, I was in SM. Oh, bakit hindi mo ko nilapitan zeros? Oh, magkita sana tayo. Right. So, yeah, I was in Cebu SM yes, Cebu yesterday. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Hindi na ko pwedeng lumabas-labas na naka naka shorts lang. <laughs> right, kasi ba yan. Um anyways, um I'll see you tomorrow. PSEI still having a hard time. I'm waiting for PSEI to break out. Pag nag-break out po yan, then since our position is all, nakaposition na po yung pera ko, nintay lang natin yung break out para tuloy-tuloy na. I hope nakapag-bodega na po kayo ngayon. Okay? Sana nakapag-bodega na kayo. So that when the market breaks out, you're already at a very good position. Um, good morning, Coach. Baka pwede din sa Novali, sa Laguna. May Seda Hotel din po dito. Oy, galang ako. Na, nagpunta ko Novali dyan. Was that last year? Uh, yeah, last year, meron akong students sa New Valley. I had to go to Laguna for the road trip na rin lang. Rod, the high. Thanks, Coach. Good luck trading. Uh, good luck then. Good morning, Coach. Pacheck po ng LHC and ISM. Sige, last lang. Okay. LHC. The, the, the beauty of MA20 na naman. Look at that. MA20 bounce. That's why I always tell you, check out MA20. Test out MA20. Those are very good supports on an uptrend stock most especially. Look at this. One, two, Three, three instances na nag MA20 siya. Those are the best entry points. LHC, wait for the pullback and bounce na lang before you wanna enter. Okay? 
Um, kasi masyado mataas na po yan. I recommended LHC yesterday on a breakout and umakyat po siya. Today, it's already too high. Stay away from it for now. ISM, um, nagpo-pullback pa. Antayin lang natin yung magandang pullback niya and bounce before you wanna get in. You don't have to buy every day. You don't have to buy now. You don't have to buy tomorrow. Always wait for your setup when it comes to trading. That's one of the patience that you need to do. So, good morning, sir. What strategy can you recommend with PIP? Nasa overbought levels ang RSI pero declared dividends. Uh, stay away from it or if it's especially if it's already oversold. Okay? Um, PIP, masyado mataas na po yan. Uh, huwag po maingit. Right? Uh, even if may dividends yan. Right? So that's it for today. I'll see you again tomorrow. Uh, remember the events. If you want to join the seminar pero wala kay sa Davao or wala kay sa Rome, there's a way to get uh, the replay of my previous seminars, my webinars. Uh, just send me a message on my Financial Freedom 101 Facebook page. I'll give you the instructions on how to access them and I'll give you the details on how to register for it. Uh, Coach Morning, PLL. Um, just keep buying the, ano, just keep buying the support as much as possible. Anyways, maaga pa naman. Let's just go to this. DMC. It's, uh, DM, uh, so DMC, wait for the breakout lang for DMC. Um, CAB and CA, um, usually hype lang yan, momentum trading for that. You don't have to enter that as of now. Uh, si X lang last, <laughs> last na naman. Um, yan, ang pullback pa. It's now playing at MA20. If it goes green, then why not if you wanna trade it? Okay, so yun lang. That's it for today. See you again tomorrow. As always, let's get rich together. Bye, everyone.